just a quick video here um, show off the uh, WWVB receivers that I got in the mail today. Um, WWVB is broadcast out of Fort Collins, not too far from here actually, north of Denver. Um, they broadcast the atomic clock time from NIST um, using their cesium clock that they have but uh, it's transmit on 60 kilohertz and just actually a really simple receiver um, picks up the uh, variance in transmission strength um, as you can see the green LEDs flashing there um, high high power is when the lights on and low power is when the lights off um, and when the light turns off signifies the beginning of a second and then uh, the data is actually encoded in how long it takes for that LED to come back on within that second. So the long blinks you see are actually a zero. The blinks where they're kind of that they just did there where it's half of the second light on or light off and then half of the second light on is a one. And then the special really, really fast blinks you'll see here in a second, like that last one. Um, is actually a special marker bit, which that's how it signifies the beginning of um, each minute and so on. Um, so they have you know, binary encoded data here in the time signal. I'm going to come up here and show you the actual chips. You won't be able to see the LEDs because I have uh, front-facing lenses on those LEDs, but as you can see, I actually have two receivers and uh, two antennas set up here in my power supply for my breadboard, but uh, in the next couple of days I plan on connecting these up with uh, an Arduino and doing the actual decoding of the time signal there, so I'll be posting more about that in a couple of days probably. Um, anyway, just thought it was kind of cool, and uh, that's all for now. See you later.